For the third straight year, Bedford Academy is looking to make a deep run into the postseason. This year, of course, like all of our years, have been rocky in the beginning. And then we pulled it together towards the end. We start peaking at the right time, like towards the end, towards the playoffs. And we were right where we want to be. The Panthers finished the regular season 19-4, and earning the fourth seed in the Class A playoffs. We have to stay consistent and we have to, you know, be there for each other because one thing about the playoffs, the playoffs can be a very emotional, rugged time. Not only is Bedford Academy dominating right here on the court, but it's what they're doing in the classroom that's even more impressive. I would take our team against any other team, AAA, you know, whatever you want to call it, as far as academics. As a team, the Panthers have a combined 92 average. To be on the team, you have to have an 80 average. So you have to work hard in, on and off the court. Coach Rob Phelps makes each player sign a contract, saying if they don't keep their grades up, they can't hit the court. There's no reason why you can't be a student athlete, a good student, and a good basketball player as well. First, he wants to make us um, good men, and then we have to have our education, and then it's basketball. I get calls from colleges. The first thing they ask me is, how am I doing it in my classes? I tell them I have a 90 average, and, and they sound ecstatic to hear that. Now that it's playoff time, Phelps hopes the Panthers' performance on the court matches it off the court. At Bedford Academy, Jason Lewis, MSG Varsity.